primary function of the spinal curves are what? Why do we have curves in our spine? Absorb shock. And what was Joe Pilates initial thoughts on the spine? Flat back. Flat back, right. And why did he think that? He thought it was better. They used to think that a straight spine was a better spine, right? But we know, he didn't, they didn't know anything about shock absorption or, or the importance of the curves for shock absorption at that time. So he was just trying to straighten everybody out and make them tall and long. And then his posture, right, is that this tucked body position, right? So um, we do want our curves. We have the lumbar is lordotic, right? The um, thoracic curve is kyphotic, and then the cervical curve, lordosis again, exactly. The sacral curve is visually posterior as the thoracic spine, but it's dependent on the position of the pelvis. Right, so the coccyx is not fixed and can move against the sacrum as well. So uh, the coccyx being just that very tip down there, right, the sacrum is going to be here. The coccyx is just the very little bit. But that, it, while it's fused, it does sometimes move a little bit, um, and some with some people more than others. So that can also move. And then here's a little bit of just remind.